Good evening and thanks for joining us for News Day Now at 6. I'm Amy DuPont. And I'm Mike Thompson. La Crosse Police are investigating a bomb threat at Central High School today. It did force the evacuation of the building this morning and students and staff were sent home for the day. News Day Now's Emily Haugen is live outside Central High School with the latest. Emily. Mike and Amy, the bomb threat was emailed to La Crosse Central Administration and then passed along to their school resource officers. And this isn't the first time Central's had to deal with something like this this school year. Monday was the first day back from the holiday break for the La Crosse School District, but it didn't last long for Central High students after a bomb threat. Then we were in our second hour class and then it was the end of class and then we got told to stay in our classes. Shortly after, students and staff were evacuated to Longfellow Middle School. And everyone got evacuated. We were in our classroom and then just got told to leave and go to Longfellow or find a ride home. Those with cars were released to drive themselves home while others were set to be picked up at Longfellow. The state patrol brought in two explosive detection canine teams to search the school. Nothing suspicious I mean, was found. I'm not too scared because it's happened. Like, I mean, we were, weren't at school for a day or two because of gun threats, and so I'm not like too scared or anything, just curious. This isn't the first threat Central's faced this year. In November, classes were canceled after a threat. That case is continued to later this month for further review. It's been very weird this year. And in December, a concerning message was found near Central High. It did not reference the school, but the police department and the school investigated the case. As of right now, today's threat is still under investigation. La Crosse Central students do not have activities tonight, but school will resume tomorrow. We'll have more updates for you as they become available. Reporting outside of Central High School, Emily Haugen for News 8 Now. All Mike right, and Amy. Thanks. thanks a lot, Emily. And anyone with information is asked to contact the Department of Justice's Speak Up, Speak Out Resource Center or the La Crosse Area Crime Stoppers.